Hey guys, my name's Steven, and you're back. 30 rupees? Oh! Hey guys, Pip here, and it's that kind of it's that time of year again. Uh, Christmas time. Uh, uh, wait, what? Oh, it's Jan. So it's the end of January, and having lots of fun today. We're talking about waifus, and waifus are an important part of life. Uh, I think everyone should live by the quote, um, happy waifu equals happy laifu, and I believe that is, like, what you should live by. You hear me? You hear me? And, uh, yeah, so hold on, I need, I'll, I'll, I'll be back, I gotta pee. So, I just finished my little pee or something, so let's, let's get into it. So, the first waifu, these aren't like in any particular order by how I like them, it's just in general. And these aren't like I guess the more popular ones, but whatever guys. Doesn't matter. So the first one is Lucy Hartfelia from Fairy Tale and the reason why she's a waifu is or in on this list is because you know she's a blonde and I actually don't really care, but I don't have a reason. So that's why. Yeah. So, all right, moving on. Uh, I mean, Fairy Tale's a good anime, and, you know, she's, um, pretty, 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 you, yeah, okay, um, okay, let's take a, take a look at my next list, uh, I mean, next, next, next. So, my next waifu is, uh, Mikasa Ackerman from, uh, Mikasa, Mikasa! Because, you know, Attack on Titan, it's just so good. Like, you know, the the popularity poll is like the colossal, colossal difference in popularity. Ha, you see what, you see what I did there, guys? Yeah? No? Okay. Alright, so the reason why I picked Mikasa was because... I'm pretty sure she's like the fan service of the whole show. And from me, I think you would all agree on that. So if you think that Mikasa is the fan service of Attack on Titan, or maybe the female Titan, hmm, I don't know. Tough question. I, uh, you can put in the comments below. I, yep, yeah. All right, and uh, number three is Yoko Littner from Gurren Lagann. Gurren Lagann! <laughs> All right, yeah, so uh, the reason why I picked it is because when I was, that was like one of the first animes I watched and she was like, like, Probably the most beautiful redhead in the entire anime community, uh, anime. Yeah. Yeah. Anime is the best, you know, at ASMR videos. I, I, I like to do those if you haven't, uh, watched. So, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so the reason why I picked Yoko is because, you know, she's not wearing any clothes. I'm I mean, <clears throat> oh, sorry, uh, because she's, uh, pretty beautiful, uh, I guess, for an anime character, and, you know, you need beautiful women, 
to have a waifu. Yeah, agree. Yeah, a pip quote, two, two, 2K16, yeah. Woohoo. And if you hear background music, well, or not background music, what am I saying? If you can hear, if you're just there's background noise, then maybe, uh, I don't know, stop watching the video. No, I'm just kidding. The video, this video should be watched throughout the whole thing. And, uh, let me put that up there. Yeah, alright, um, who's next? Uh, oh my gosh. <sighs> this next one. So revolutionary. What am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? <laughs> from Kuroko no Basket. <laughs> if you haven't watched Kuroko no Basket, I think you should. Because it's a good show. And why I picked her over all the other women or young women uh they're in high school right uh yeah because uh i don't know <laughs> yeah so that's why i think yeah but it's okay boobs are overrated <laughs> Um, next on my list is uh, Hitoka Yachi from Haikyuu. Uh, Haikyuu is a pretty good anime. Haikyuu is like volleyball, like pa 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 Boobs are overrated, and she doesn't have boobs, and she's a, I guess, a pretty cute anime character. I mean, I guess I could have picked uh, the other girl, I think her name, she moves, she do boobs, but I don't know. I don't know her name off the top of my head. But that's okay. That is A-okay, guys. Tell me. Alright, um, next. I don't even know how many I have. Uh, Sasha, uh, Sasha... Sa Sasha, Sa Sasha Blouse from Attack on Titan. The reason why I picked her because she's relatable. She eats a lot of food, so if you, and she's pretty cute, I guess. I don't know. Why am I doing this video? Ah, whatever. But uh, yeah. So yes. And then Sasha. Uh, so if you wanna, if you wanna get her attention, you gotta bring food. Lots of food. Because she eats food. Lots of it. <laughs> if, yeah, but uh, the, the last one is, uh, not last one, but the next one is Hestia. And Hestia is a lolly, and lollies are lollies, and I think you should consider a lolly. Yeah, and she holds her boobs up with a ribbon. It's not possible. That's pretty cool. But she's a lolly. But that doesn't matter. She doesn't wear shoes. So, yeah, from Don Machi, I think. Yeah, uh. Woo! Boo! 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 Yeah, okay, last one is uh, Tornado or Tats Tatsumaki from One Punch Man. One Punch Man! Woo! One of the episodes, if you, if you, like, 
I don't know, pause the video, you'll see some bald heads. This video wasn't very exciting, but One Punch Man. Yeah, so, if you like that, if you like this video, you should like the video, and if you didn't like this video, you should still like it, and comment. But if you disagree with my list, guys, just comment down below on uh, why you disagree, and I'm really itchy. And, yeah, so, I'll catch you in the next video, guys! Ah! Hey guys, I have Pip here, and today's video 